I'm here in Medjugorje and I'm this, what's your name? I'm here in Medjugorje, my name is Bernadette. I came here in 2013 with my husband, I came on my honeymoon. Oh, wow. My husband was ma previously married but his wife died of cancer mm -hmm. and um, his oldest daughter was killed in a road accident. So we just met by chance. He's a, he's a tenor, he does a lot of singing in the church mm -hmm. and um, he has a sister and nun and um, I was organising a, a charity event and mm -hmm. I met John at, at the event. Mm -hmm. And um, so we, be, we, we I, have, I, I actually heard him singing before I actually saw him. Mm -hmm. I, hadn't, I, I just heard his beautiful voice and I, I, I found him anyway and I said, it, it, your singing was beautiful, it made, it made the night. And uh, we had a cup of coffee and then we started, we developed a friendship and after that then we've been, we've been together for the last uh, 12 years. We got married in Gozo, uh -huh. in the island of Gozo, uh -huh. and we flew over to Bari, and then we got um, on the, Adri we came across the Adriatic over to here, uh -huh. and I loved it, it was beautiful. Uh -huh. It was beautiful. Why it, was it so beautiful? It was beautiful because, um, it, you know, it was, easy, it was easy to pray here. I found it very easy to pray. I was found it to be very in touch with my spiritual, my uh -huh. spiritual side, whereas before, I didn't find it that easy to pray or to connect with God. Mm -hmm. But I found when I was here, it was it was a cakewalk. It was it was it was very easy. Mm -hmm. It was very it was very easy, mm -hmm. and um, I just found a peace. That I did, I, you know, I'm very happy. I, I must be the happiest girl in the world. I have a wonderful husband. Mm -hmm. But I found a, I found an inner peace that somehow I was that somehow I was missing. Mm -hmm. That that just wasn't there. You know, I found that inner peace here. Mm -hmm. I thought it was actually beautiful and I got the desire to come back year after year after year. How I always want to come back. This would be my, um, this must be about my fifth, 14th time. Wow. It's my 14th time. We've been staying here now for the last three weeks. We're mm -hmm. staying in the flat, mm -hmm. just right next door to here. Mm -hmm. we, we booked it for, for a month, mm -hmm. but I became ill and um, I could only come over for three weeks. Mm -hmm. So we're flying home now this evening. Wow. So we're getting our coach now at 4:30, mm -hmm. and John had made sandwiches oh. and and a drink because mm -hmm. because the airport is very expensive and we do save up. We're not well off, you know what I mean. Mm -hmm. We could corners so we, we could we could corners that we can come over here. So mm -hmm. we've made some sandwiches and um, got mm -hmm. some drinks, mm -hmm. and uh, we had to walk back up back mm -hmm. down from the village to come up and get them. Mm -hmm. So this that's this is where we're at really. And what would you tell people why should they come to Medjugorje? What is so special about the place? Well, it, it, there's a great peace here. Mm -hmm. There's a great peace here, and uh, the, the love of our lady is here. Mm -hmm. I find I'm very close to our lady. Mm -hmm. We have a grotto at home in our back garden, but I, I find that I find that I find very I'm very close to her here. Mm -hmm. I, I find that I'm really really close to our lady here, wow. and I find that your problems aren't magnified as much mm -hmm. when you're in a when you're when you're in a place like this. You can feel our mother's love mm -hmm. when you're here, when you're here. That's what I would say. I would say a common experience, the, the love of our mother in heaven. That's what I, I, that would be my message. Wow, thank yeah. you so much for this interview. You're, you're welcome.